The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. We begin the Carson Newman Volleyball position previews with senior Aaron Edwards. I'm Michael Watrang for the Eagles Sports Network as we take a look at the middles and outsides for the Eagles this season. And Aaron, uh, obviously you've had a really nice last couple years uh, with the SAC Tournament MVP, all conference selections in there as well. Uh, Entering your final season, what are some personal goals for you as you uh, go about your, your final year of action here? Honestly, trying to get that All-American honor. Been working for that the past, you know, four years now, and this is my last final year. So if I can get that, that would be great. What has been the biggest key to, to your development? Because for a long time, uh, the athleticism was always apparent, but you've really put it together with the ability to not just block that you were when you were younger, but now to be able to terminate the ball. What's been the key to, to your development over the last few years? Really just not playing scared because I used to be very afraid to make mistakes. And if I made a mistake, you know, I'm super hard on myself. So when I made one mistake, I would just play timid. And so now I just, you know, say whatever happens, happens. And I just go for the kill every time. This year, you're going to have a target on your back. Uh, Megan Oldenberger is gone. Uh, Katie Parnell and Kana Rorcassi are gone as well. Uh, it is a very... Uh, inexperienced group in terms of uh, players along the front line that have played significant uh, sets for this team. So knowing that you were going to be a key target for other teams, what does that do to your mindset? That really just makes my confidence go up more because I love to be the one that everyone looks at, you know, to beat or to shut down because, I mean, I don't shut down. <laughs> so um, <laughs> I really just take that and I just like run with that and just make sh- and that makes my game level go up even more. So um, I like having that on my back. With that in mind, you do lose Megan Oldenberger, who was an all-conference selection last year. Kana and Katie were amongst the top blockers in the entire country throughout their career. Losing those pieces, uh, how difficult is that for this year's group to try to, to overcome those losses with uh, some young players out there that, that do have a lot of talent? It's definitely going to be difficult because they had years of experience, but um, I have a lot of confidence in this group. We just had an open gym yesterday. It was my first time practicing with them, and honestly, I was surprised with what I saw. I wasn't expecting that. Um, The chemistry is there. Still need to work on some communication, but it's still the beginning, and we have a long ways to go. Taylor Kieran uh, played a lot on the right side. Uh, I know she's potentially working throughout the middle this year. She can pretty much play any of the front front line positions. Julia Wheeler is now over uh, transferring in as well. You you got plenty of players along that front line. What's going to be the key for for that group this year to get their legs underneath them? Because you play 32 matches this season. Really, just for them to you know have confidence. You know, this is their year to shine. I mean, like everyone's just kind of on the same level right now. So it's not like anyone has a promised spot. So I feel like it's a great position for them to be in. And I really think they can be a huge asset to us this year. And then for you, uh, a SAC tournament championship, a regional championship, a lot of wins over the last few years. With that, now you're a leader. You're one of the players that uh, has played the most among the most sets on the entire roster. How do you try to use your leadership to guide some of those younger players to be ready when September hits? Really just let them know that, I mean, these four years go by super fast and every opportunity that presents itself, just make the best of it. No need to hold back. Just put everything out on the court and whatever happens, happens. Aaron, thanks so much for the time. Best of luck this year. Thank you. She's Aaron Edwards. I'm Michael Watrang for the Eagle Sports Network.